Hello, when comparing the Google XML sitemaps and the Yoast SEO sitemap, we will look into the Yoast XML sitemaps functions. So in general, the max entries per sitemap is 1000, it's default and maybe lower than the, the Google XML sitemaps because it has more functionality to have great amount of links so it's another things that you can see the sitemap can exclude some things and also the post types that you can disallow and the excluded posts that you can choose in Yoast SEO sitemaps so the taxonomies and as you can see the categories tags format and topic tags so i will not use the Yoast seo sitemap so click untick this box and save change so we will gonna activate the google xml sitemaps in order to get one focusing about sitemap functionality on wordpress because it's very important if you have one targeted plugin about xml sitemaps for google seo that's why we are, I am choosing to disallow, to disable Yoast SEO sitemap. We can already be able to allow, activate our old Google XML sitemaps. So I am go into going into installed plugins page so click activate google xml sitemaps the xml site old so these are the settings it provides much more settings in order to create great sitemaps so what we're gonna choose this is the plugin that is great for creating sitemaps and the best one is xml sitemaps by arne grohl thanks for watching